Okay, we are in Audacity. Now we are in Audacity for the Mac, but that doesn't matter. The Audacity PC version, Linux version, they all work the same way. What we're going to do here is now we're going to pull in through the import audio. We're going to grab the two files and they're in my MOL folder, which is right. Where put that? There we go. Me. Um, MOLP, uh, this is the track file of just myself. You can hear it here. You get the idea? It's just me. Nothing that exciting. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to add the Alex audio, which was at MOL68.mp3. Now, notice my version was a WAV file. Alex's version was a high bitwit MP3 file. Doesn't matter. That's one of the um, great benefits of, of this methodology. And uh, we'll show you how this works here. So we're importing in the file. Now, if we play them together, you'll see uh, we're going to increase the size here. Go to the beginning. And you'll see here. And then you can see here, Alex will go. So you can see here was where I did the four, the second 4321. Here is where Alex did the second 4321. We're going to click on this selection here. We're going to do this. And now, by lining that stuff up, now we've got a good recording, or at least a good lineup. So you can see here, here's where I start speaking. Everybody, welcome to Marketing Online Live. And when we go to the place where Alex speaks, you can see how the transition works here. You doing this morning, Alex? I am doing great. See how that goes? Let me go a couple other transitions just to make sure everything looks good. Any quality comments on that? No, I, 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 think, I think you're dead on. Here we go. How about a week? Wait. Or you may be at the... See we go. So let's go further down, make sure we're good here at the end. We're not talking over each other. So what we've done is we've just mixed these two together. So now we're going to export that as a WAV file. And it warns that it's going to be mixed down to a single mono channel. That's fine. And we're going to put that again in this MOL demo folder that I've put together. That's MO68. I usually do F for final. And now it's going to create this single track. It takes a second for the WAV file to be done. And then once we do that, we'll just trim it and we'll be good to go. Okay. Close this up. Now, let's import in the, the audio that we mixed. And that was the uh, final audio. Now you'll notice this will just be the one track, but it'll be me and Alex talking together. Now, usually you're able to tell from the volumes um, when people are speaking up and whatnot. Let's trim the very beginning of this. All right, recording. Four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Okay. So we'll trim that there. Get rid of that. And you can see now it'll start right away. Everybody, welcome to Marketing Online Live. This Beautiful. Close to the end here. You can see. I think we just stopped right there, right? All right, thanks. Off we go. Okay, speak to you. Bye. Beautiful. Edit that out. And now we have it with the final. So we export that again. And we're just going to overwrite the um, one we did. And I'll say, is it okay to overwrite it? You bet it is. So now we have the WAV file of Alex and I chatting back and forth with each other. It was that clean. And uh, now we'll run it through the uh, Levelator product. Gigavox. Now this is done very, very simple. We're going to take the file that we created here. 
of uh, final. I'm going to drag that over to the level later. This is it. We drag and drop. And again, yes, I'm using a Mac here. My track, we took Alex's track, we brought them into the same thing. We lined them up so that, that we were, you know, um, in conjunction with each other. We did that with the 4321, 4321 cadence. And then by doing those two things together, we've got a really simple track recording. And then we produced a wave. We snipped the beginning and the end to make it perfect for what people needed. And then we ran it through the levelator to give it the exact volume. And now you've got the track of Alex and I in conversation with each other, sounding like it came from a studio. This happens in just a few minutes, as you can tell, and is really a nice, clean way to do this kind of thing. So we're about 56% of the way here recording. What will happen um, next, and we won't put this in the video because it's a bit boring, but what will happen next is I will take the audio, I'll put the music at the beginning at the end. I can either do that um, through a system like Audacity. I can use that through a system like Sony SoundForge. I can do that through an automated podcast system, whatever I want to do. And we produce the MP3 file, and then we put that online for the world to enjoy. Once that's done, we have the high-quality version that might go on a CD or something at some point, and we have the MP3 version that goes out to the general world all through this simple little interface. So that is it. That's how we do it. And I'm glad I could share it with you. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Bye.